smoke traveling from the western wildfires is reaching all the way across the U.S., bringing vibrant red sunsets and moon glow to the east. But it's also carrying poor air quality and harmful health effects thousands of miles away from the flames. Large fires have been actively burning for weeks across the western U.S. and Canada. Currently, the largest in the U.S. is the Bootleg Fire in Oregon, which has now burned more than 600 square miles of land and become so large it generates its own weather. For days, eastern states have been trapped in a smoky haze originating from the fires across the nation. Smoke has settled over major cities nearly 3,000 miles from the fires, including Philadelphia and New York, and even in the eastern parts of Canada. It's the second year in a row that smoke has traveled so far into the east. The site has become normal during wildfire season as fires have become more intense, long-lasting, and dangerous because of climate change. Julie Malingowski, an emergency response meteorologist with the National Weather Service, told NPR that smoke pushed high into the atmosphere at the location of the fires is now being pushed down onto eastern states. We're seeing quite a bit of smoke near the surface level across parts of the eastern U.S., she said. Normally, as smoke moves further away from the active fire, the smoke tends to disperse into higher parts of the atmosphere, so it's not as thick at the surface, Malingowski said. But she said that this time an area of high pressure is pushing that smoke down toward the surface.